Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're going to be doing gameplay with the brand new end game Dirk Nowitzki. And the fact that Dirk can play small forward is kind of crazy. Never have we, we've never had a Dirk that can play small forward. A seven foot one at small forward, I think that's really good. And that makes Dirk even more viable than he already was going to be as an end game because he was already going to be an elite card on the level of guys like Shaq and Embiid and David Robinson. But now at small forward, he's going to be probably the second or third best small forward in the game after Wimby and probably Bull Bull. But after in game Bull Bull and Invincible Wimby, I do think Dirk is the next best small forward in the game and will be a top five small forward in the game for the rest of the year. Absolutely exceptional card who I am super excited to use. The other thing to mention, Dirk is my favorite player of all time. I love Dirk. So seeing him get the respect he deserves in 2K and being an elite level card at the end of the year is absolutely awesome. So before we hop into the video, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help me push towards the 13,000 subscriber mark on the channel. I upload every single day and I would really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe. And without further ado, let's hop right into it. Let's see what Big Dirk is looking like. So 7-1 at small forward is incredible size. 99 stats across the board, not a surprise either as an end game card. And then he's got every single Hall of Fame badge in the game. So he is incredibly complete and incredible incredibly good all the way around his animations of course are going to be all the end game animations as well but we'll still take a look at them because why not i like to show off every card in freestyle even if we know they're going to play exactly the same as all the other end games but of course those animations are uh oh does dirk not have the misdirection either okay that's interesting so it must be a weight thing or something because dirk and Jokic can't misdirection and all the other cards that i've used that are in game cards so far can't so does that mean like yao ming's not gonna be able to misdirection because he's too heavy i honestly don't know that's interesting i didn't know that was really a thing but you can't trigger the misdirection with Dirk, so that's something to keep in mind. With that being said, still don't think that's going to stop him from being an absolutely elite level card. The one thing is, Trey, uh, Bull Bull, and Wimby can both trigger that misdirection and are both bigger than Dirk as well. But Dirk's player build is really good, so I do think that does relegate him just a little bit to being the third best small forward in the game. But like, he's gonna be the third best small forward in the game probably for the rest of the year, and at worst, probably fourth or fifth, considering we might maybe get another one or two seven foot type guys at the small forward position who are in game level cards. I don't know. This Dirk card is still gonna be exceptional, even without the ability to do the trade misdirection i still think he's going to be absolutely incredible he's got the trade fade of course his movement is elite as all these in-game cards are he's going to dunk the ball at an incredibly high level he's going to do everything at a super high level on the court and of course going to be one of the better cards in my team so super excited to hop into this game and see what dirt can do so without further ado let's do let's do let's do just that and see what the germinator is looking like gonna be completely honest i do not have high expectations for our opponent although he just triggered that what in the world all right, whatever. Push the ball at the court. Uh, Manute, just dump it down to Dirk. Dirk goes standing. Hey, stay dunk. Yes, sir. Easy bucket for Dirk. Run the floor in transition. He's got MJ. He's got uh, Invincible Tatum. Um, In-game Curry at the two for some reason. And then Giannis and Wilf. Like, not a horrible team. He's got all Dark Matters and stuff. And they're not terrible Dark Matters. But it's not an elite level squad. And we have the team we have, which is freaking Manute and Dirk and Wimby and Jokic. And just a crazy elite team. In-game Paul George as well. It's tough to compete against. Now, admittedly, good shot by him there. Straight off the slide. Pull up for three that's a great shot Dirk can I just green shots today man I don't know why I can't shoot the ball it is a real shame good tip Dirk kick it right back out to him I could have just shot that I'm actually just gonna shoot this one that's a wide open and that's a buck yes sir there we go green in that one with Dirk knocks down the three and we are up five two three like that a lot let's play some defense I'm not too worried about this dude uh, in all honesty between him having his meter on and all that and his team just not being that great so just got to play some decent defense and we will be in a very very solid spot good defense contest Tatum he misses badly and we are going to leak out in transition Dirk Nowitzki all the way to them spin move dunk hey what a great spin move right there as well no one who's probably going to jump spin away from it and we get ourselves an easy dunk out of it in transition good offense so far Dirk pushing the ball up the court again I was going to try to walk back for a three but it did not trigger the walk back animation the way that I wanted to still chill I could have probably shot that I'm shooting this one I'm shooting that one I think I got space oh my gosh I was right I had just enough space to get that shot off and Dirk greens at a quick 10 points finally you having an in-game game gameplay where I feel like I'm not struggling to score the ball I don't know what's been going on these last few gameplays but it hasn't been quite as clean as I'd like good D clicked on beautifully again there Dirk all the way to the rim Co, I wanted a contact dunk so bad I was trying to trigger one it wasn't there but an amazing start to the gameplay let's hop into another game and let's keep it going all right, this two's team makes me laugh because he's actually got like a pretty decent squad for the most part. He's got Laurie Markinen out here at the three, which is a little bit of a weird card, but he's got Wimby. He's got Dirk. Great shot. I'm sorry. I have Dirk. He has Yao. All right. Well, I wasn't even done talking. He had Muggsy Bugs in his lineup, so that's what I was going to say, which is funny. But quick quit. One more game, I guess. We knocked down a four-pointer. We'll take it. Let's hop into one more. 
Our third and final matchup for this video, at least hopefully. All right, great team. Steph is an amazing. The rest of the squad, though, is elite. And we have the hardest matchup possible for Dirk as well in Invincible Wimbanyama. So love to see that. Honestly, very, very fair squads besides him having Steph and me having Jokic at PGs. But I get a freaking illegal scream. No, it wasn't illegal scream. I thought it was an illegal scream, but Wimby gets called for the foul there. So I like the fact that it's such a fair matchup. And honestly, him having Steph doesn't make it really that unfair of a matchup because I'm not really attacking Steph. I'm doing my gameplay centered around Dirk, not Jokic. So if this was a Jokic gameplay, it'd be pretty unfair, but it isn't. Trey Fade, Dirk Nowitzki, 4-3, knocks it down. Love that Trey Fade, man. If y'all if y'all don't use the Trey Fade, you got to get into your arsenal, man, because it's such an effective and elite move in my team. So let's see what Dirk can do. In a regular game, I'd probably switch uh, my Wimby onto his Wimby and have Dirk guard d -Rob, but I want to see what Dirk can do defensively against Wimby in this game, how much of a mismatch Wimby is against a guy like Dirk who's only quote unquote only seven foot one at the small board position like that makes him small but hit our pop catch shit i was trying to bail out to Wimby. that was not a shot that i was intending to shoot somehow that winds up being my ball anyway because he touched it as it went out of bounds or whatever so i guess i will take that i would backdoor here and just get a dunk with with Jokic, but this is not a Jokic gameplay this is a dirt gameplay standing dunk hey i don't know what you're jumping out with Wimby, but i'll take the standing and we have five quick points again with dirk so third game is still cooking which i love to see good defense here now rotate back to Wimby. good d get a hand up on curry he's just running around in circles good d he's just running around in circles and we cut it off absolutely perfectly good stuff dirk running the floor in transition walking back chill good move dirk oh my god he just cooked him i'm loving what i'm seeing out of mr nowitzki right now this card is having a crazy amount of success and he is super fun to use as well love what i'm seeing dirk wimby to dirk dirk pump fake chill Asta slide, Francis size up, stop, pop, don't need much space, and I smoked it because I'm garbage. Oh my gosh, that is tough. Pick up the ball, Derek. Pick up the ball. You can guard Wimby. You can guard Wimby. Why is he wide open? It doesn't matter. Guard rotate. Guard two minute. Good. Get back to D Rob. D Rob. Good D. Dirk. Oh my gosh. Dirk D. Dirk playing paint D. Dirk playing paint D. Chill. We're jumping for joy. What am I doing? I don't know what's going on. We're good though. Wim Minute. You're sl much slower than Curry, but we can get there. We're good. Get through this. X switch. X switch. Dirk contest. I played such bad defense, but he can't shoot. Let's go. I don't know what's going on right now. I'm just this is a mess, but I'm liking this Dirk card. A ton, bro. He's so nice. That's just such a good card. Let's get him over two more buckets, though. We'll call it a gameplay because I think we're pretty much chilling at this point. Dirk off the pop. Attack Wimby. Stop. Pop. Don't need a lot of space. I missed it. I thought I was going to get a load up. I didn't. I timed it too late. Damn, this re this release uh, is so fast, but it can be so inconsistent at times at times because like you almost don't know if you're going to get a load up or not or whatever. And it's kind of frustrating, but I think our opponent is out of here or something. He's stalling or whatever. I'm not totally sure, but regardless. Oh, there he goes. Let's hop back into the main menu. And let's review the card. Dirk is really good. I still think Wimby and Bull Bull are a little better because, well, Wimby's seven foot five and insane. And then Bull Bull is seven foot two, so he's a little bigger than Dirk, and he can trigger the misdirection, which gives him a slight advantage in terms of his movement. But Dirk is a top tier elite card who can complete, compete with the best cards in the game at the small forward position and is the third best small forward in my team right now. Card is amazing, and he's super fun to use, especially for a Mavs fan like me. Definitely going to try to get Dirk on my own account. So hopefully y'all did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. I'll be back with more. 2k content very very soon and i appreciate y'all peace